In the world of BMW performance, few rivalries have sparked more debate than this one, the B58 versus the S55. Two inline-six engines that define two completely different philosophies. One, the B58, a masterpiece of modern engineering, smooth, refined, and deceptively powerful. The other, the S55, a wild twin-turbo beast bred purely for the M division's purpose, domination. One represents the future of BMW's modular platform. The other, the raw spirit of motorsport engineering. But here's the question. Which engine truly captures the soul of BMW performance? And which one is just better in the real world? Let's dive into the history, the tech, the tuning, and the truth behind BMW's turbocharged duel of the decade. Before we start comparing these two beasts, we have to understand their DNA, because both the B58 and the S55 come from the same bloodline, yet were raised in completely different worlds. The B58 debuted in 2015 as part of BMW's modular engine lineup, a 3.0-liter inline-six designed to be efficient, powerful, and flexible across BMW's range. It powered everything from the understated 340i sedan to the aggressive Z4 M40i and even Toyota's GR Supra. But beneath that smooth refinement was an engineering masterpiece, a closed deck block for strength, an integrated exhaust manifold to manage temperatures, and a water-to-air intercooler built directly into the intake plenum. This wasn't just another turbocharged inline-six, it was a precision instrument designed for smooth torque, balance, and everyday reliability. BMW had found a way to make performance feel effortless. Then comes the S55, the wild twin in the family. Unveiled in 2014 in the F80 M3 and F82 M4, this engine replaced the naturally aspirated S65 V8, a motor that was pure theater. The S55 didn't try to mimic that drama, instead, it created its own. Built by BMW's M division, it took the base N55 design and pushed it to the edge. Twin turbochargers, forged internals, track spec cooling, and a 7600 RPM redline. The S55 was a statement. It didn't care about comfort or refinement. It was designed to destroy lap times and embarrass rivals. So here we have two inline sixes, born from the same heritage but forged for entirely different purposes. One built for composure and control, the other for chaos and adrenaline. Now, let's crack these engines open and see what they're really made of. The B58 uses a single twin-scroll turbocharger, feeding all six cylinders through an ultra-precise 500-bar direct injection system one of the highest pressure systems BMW ever built at the time. The result? Instant throttle response and beautifully smooth power delivery with almost zero lag. But that's not all. BMW engineered this thing like a tank, closed deck aluminum block for immense rigidity, forged crankshaft and connecting rods for strength, oil to water heat exchanger for better temperature control, and that built-in charge air cooler that kills heat soak during hard pulls. Every component was built with efficiency and reliability in mind. The B58 doesn't scream, it purrs with confidence. It's the silent killer of the BMW lineup. Now, the S55, that's another story. Two mono scroll turbos, one per cylinder bank, custom built for razor sharp response and it revs to 7,600 RPM, something you rarely see in a turbo inline six. BMW's M engineers went all in. Closed deck block, again, but strengthened even more. Lightweight forged crank and rods, upgraded cooling and lubrication systems, and individualized Vanos and Valvetronic tuning. The S55 makes 425 horsepower in the base, M3, M4, and 444 horsepower in the competition model. 
but real-world dynos show closer to 470 at the crank. That's power you can feel in your chest. The difference is clear. The B58 is smooth, balanced, and sophisticated. The S55 is mechanical fury, loud, fast, and feral. This is where these two engines reveal their personalities. Step into a B58-powered car, like the M340i or Toyota Supra, and you'll instantly feel the torque. 369 LBFT from just 1600 RPM, that's near instant acceleration. It glides forward effortlessly, delivering power so clean and linear that you almost forget it's turbocharged. It's the kind of engine you can drive every day, silent when cruising, but brutally quick when provoked. It's civilized muscle, a perfect blend of comfort and power. Then there's the S55, a completely different animal. Power hits harder, faster, and more violently. When those twin turbos spool, the car lunges forward like it's been kicked by a rocket. The steering tightens, the chassis stiffens, and the engine's raw snarl fills the cabin. It's unpredictable, exciting, and borderline intimidating. This isn't a motor that wants to cruise. It wants to hunt. And then, there's the sound. The B-58 hums with a deep, smooth tone, classy and composed. The S-55? It's mechanical rage, raspy, metallic, and unapologetically raw. Some call it harsh, others call it character. Either way, you'll never forget it. If the B-58 feels like a well-tailored suit, the S-55 is a ripped leather jacket. Now, let's get to the fun part, tuning. The B-58 has become the modern-day hero for tuners. With just a stage one tune and downpipe, you're already seeing 450, 500 horsepower. Throw in E85 fuel, upgraded turbos, and a high flow intake, and you can hit 600, 650 wheel horsepower, all on stock internals. That's unheard of reliability for this level of boost. The B-58's closed-deck design and smart cooling make it nearly bulletproof. It's the perfect balance of reliability and insanity. But then, we have the S-55. This motor was born for abuse. With just a simple ECU tune, you're looking at 500, 550 wheel horsepower. And with hybrid turbos and supporting mods, 700 plus wheel horsepower is within reach. It's a tuner's dream, but also a mechanic's nightmare if you don't respect it. Vanos issues, crank hub slips, and heat management become real concerns once you push it hard. The B-58 is the clever tuner's playground. Plug, play, and go fast reliably. The S-55 is the hardcore builder's dream. Immense reward, but risk baked into every pull. Two roads to power, one smooth, one savage. Both legendary. When it comes to real-world ownership, this is where the B-58 shines. It's everything enthusiasts ever wanted. Powerful, efficient, reliable, and stress-free to own. Owners routinely push past 100,000 miles with minimal maintenance. No chronic oil leaks, no random overheating, no drama. It's one of BMW's most dependable engines ever made, and that's saying something. The S55, however, is a bit more high-maintenance. It's a race-bred engine, and it behaves like one. Crank hub issues, oil consumption, and heat stress are well documented. It's not an engine that loves traffic jams or long idles. It's happiest screaming down a back road or a racetrack. But for purists, that's the magic. It's flawed, but thrilling. It doesn't want to be tamed. It wants to be respected. The B-58 is the engine you trust. The S-55 is the engine you chase adrenaline with. Different purposes, same passion. So, who wins the battle, B-58 or S-55? If you're chasing refinement, daily reliability, and effortless tuning, the B-58 is your hero. 
it's the engine that proves BMW can still blend performance with maturity, power with grace. But if you crave emotion, connection, and the kind of rawness that reminds you why M still matters, the S55 is unbeatable. It's flawed, loud, temperamental, but unforgettable. At the end of the day, both engines represent BMW's evolution. One looking forward, one carrying the flame from the past. And maybe that's the real answer. You don't have to choose between them. You just have to decide. Do you want perfection or passion?